Good cop, bad cop. Good cop. Seattle Sound Transit Suspect Shot by Police Seattle Police released this surveillance footage showing the moments leading up to the officers opening fire on Oscar Perez Giran at the Sound Transit Soto Station on June 30th. The incident began when the suspect was unable to prove he paid his fare and refused to provide his ID. Transit police escorted Perez Giran and two others off the train around 4 p.m. Several minutes passed by before King County Sheriff's Deputy Malcolm Elliott arrived to offer support. Police questioned the suspect peacefully for several minutes until he stood up and started wrestling with the officers. Perez Giran then pulled out a gun and pointed the weapon at the officer. The video may be blurry, but look closely, it's there. Deputy Elliott acted quick to block the weapon and draw his own. The deputy fired three times, fatally wounding the 23-year-old. One of the suspect's friends, Mario Parra, saw his friend in trouble and thought about jumping in to help. He quickly changed his mind after considering sharing the same fate as his fallen friend. Police later found a stolen 9mm handgun and two full clips of ammo hidden in Mario Parra's backpack. Para has been charged with illegal weapons possession, while Deputy Elliott has been placed on paid leave. A GoFundMe account has been started to raise money for Perez Giran's funeral expenses. Michel Aguilar, his cousin, said he was undocumented and may have resisted officers out of fear of being deported to Mexico.